Now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So more than 15 years, the gap in age between these two fighters, with some differences in height, but big differences in reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet six inches tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Mecca, Saudi Arabia, Black Mamba. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down right now. And with that, we are underway from the United Center here in the Windy City, Chicago, Illinois. It opens up with a front kick. Good punch. Away, trading blows. So his opponent lands that kick to the body, Joe, and he has shown an increased susceptibility to that strike here tonight. Swung with a haymaker. Here, Joe, single leg attempt does not materialize. Kick to the head. Under three minutes now to go in round one. Lands a hard kick. Body kick, look at that. Big body shot. Body. Good exchange there. Tags him with the straight. Nice job there by McGregor. Oh, flying knee! Oh, very nice. Orthodox for much of the fight. He's going southpaw here, Joe. 
Just over two minutes now to go. The stance switches continue. Back to Selka. Just out of the range with that right hand. Oh, the body was wide open because the opponent took advantage. Kick to the body, lands flush. He's going to have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Unable to connect with the wrist. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Damaging strike there. Takedown defense has held up thus far. And he lands a nice kick. He landed that inside leg kick. Changes his stance. We'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Conor McGregor gets caught with that punch. He's got to figure out a way to get that guard higher, Joe. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. And he connects there. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Beautiful knee. He switched stances back to southpaw here. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Went for the head kick. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by McGregor. Punches block. Yeah, these are, what did you say about my mother punches? Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. Oh, and he continues to stuff oh, these takedown attempts. Stop. Let's take a look at it again here. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Very impressive striking going on in that round. Stay focused, okay? I want your striking to be a little bit sharper. Punches go. The lovely Brittany Palmer is with us. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, let's get to round two. All right, so second round getting underway here. Competitive first round, Joe. Not necessarily a round of the year per se, but high-level action on both sides. Both fighters had their moments. Your thoughts on what we saw over the first five minutes? Oh, nice punch there by McGregor. Oh, he landed it. This is a huge hook to the head. Oh, he another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. Nice kick right there. Conor McGregor gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Playing with the inside leg kick. They are trading huge punches here. Oh, oh beautiful hook there. Hard left hook. with that hook, but misses. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Connor. Looking for the left hook. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Catches the leg there, but then lets it go. No harm, no foul. Able to thwart the single leg takedown attempt there. Checks the leg kick, Joe. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. 
McGregor gets caught with that punch. Try to establish that jab. McGregor going for the leg kick, he misses. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Oh, hook to the head by Connor. He's being creative in there. Well, he stayed committed to the body work and the results are there, Joe. Look at the right side of his body. That's how you defend the single leg. Excellent movement here on the ground. Two minutes to go round two. <laughs> Trying to stay out of that clinch, Joe, once again, he's able to do so. Very nice leg kick there by McGregor. Oh! Conor McGregor gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Well, if you're gonna leave your body that wide open, you're gonna pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Going orthodox now. McGregor gets hammered by that solid uppercut. That one got his attention. Nice spinning attack to the body lands for him. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Kick lands. Oh. Excellent exchange there. Oh, McGregor's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Shooting for the takedown here. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by McGregor. Slips. And the kick lands. He got lit up. Joe stance switch once again. Those, they'll still stun you. And a very high volume of strikes continues from Conor McGregor. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by McGregor. He eats a high one. He tagged him with that right hand. Pretty good shot there. And a miss with the right hand. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Ten minutes in the box. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Incredible striking on display in that round. Thank you very much, Ariane Celeste is here. Third round underway. All right, so next round underway here, and you gotta admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. And there he swung with a haymaker. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Here. Side kick. Oh, 
Ooh, tagged him. Unable to connect with a right hook. Oh, working hard here against the fence. We'll see if he can get the takedown. Well, he left his head open there, Joe. He got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Blocks that kick to the body. Just missed with the left there. Changes his stance. Nice jab by McGregor. That punch will work right through the guard. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Strong straight left there. Oh! So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Nice liver shot there. He's trying to stay up. He is in big, big trouble. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Good shot. And there's a nice jab. How about that shin? Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Going for the single right now. First takedown attempt is there. Nicely timed sweep, and now he's in half guard. Trying to set up the twister. Constantly staying busy. Nice sweep here, he's got half guard. Now he's in full guard. He takes the back. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by McGregor. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Well, he's been on his back here, but he's actually doing some pretty effective work. Joe lands a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done there by McGregor. Oh, armbar. Looks like he's got that armbar locked in tight. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. So the fighter was really caught in a submission there just as the horn sounded. Safe to say he was saved by the bell there. So back to the stools they go. 60 seconds to recover here. We're going to fight on, ladies and gentlemen. Another round coming up. And here we see some really technical offense with submissions. And here we see that again. Ariane Celeste is holding it down. All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. At the end of that round, his... Wow! He's hanging on here. Oh, he clipped him.
Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. A right punch followed by a left there by McGregor. Excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. Oh, you can feel the breeze there. Swing and a miss by McGregor. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Oh! Whoa! This could be it right here. Takedown. He's got his leg here. Scoots his hips forward first. He wants to get that heel underneath his armpit. Laces that leg over the top of his opponent's leg. Slides his arm up. Gets the heel underneath the crook of his elbow. He got it. He got it. Nicely done. He used excellent technique, established the position, got the tap. Yeah, Joe, it's not all the time in modern-day mixed martial arts that we see fights finished with those leg attacks and those leg locks, but his technique was on point here tonight. Beautifully trapped the opponent's leg. There was nowhere to go, and ultimately no other choice but to tap out. Let's see this ankle lock one more time. This is how it's done. Absolutely perfect technique here for the tap. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So there he is, your winner by submission tonight. And that is how you put the rest of the division on notice. A huge result for him here tonight. All right, the official decision is inside the octagon. That's where we find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 41 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by a tap out due to a heel hook. Let Bamba! So there he is, your winner by way of submission. And candidly, Joe, I'm not sure this night could have gone any better. He did have some doubters coming in. He said, I got to mute those naysayers. And they're not going to keep quiet unless I can actually get this guy out of there. So mission accomplished. No judges necessary tonight. He gets the submission. And now all that's left is to celebrate.